Rachel Rakina, Rerehiko. Rachel Rakina's Rerehiko uses a very modern form of making art, digital images and sound, to reflect on a very modern form of communication, email. The work looks at what this new way of communicating has meant for contemporary Maori culture. Rerehiko was shown in Te Puawai o Naitahu, an exhibition held to mark the opening of the new Christchurch Art Gallery, Te Puna o Waifatu, in 2003. The exhibition acknowledged the special relationship between the art gallery and Naitahu, the South Island iwi, or tribal group, that is strongly associated with the Christchurch region and celebrated the vibrancy of contemporary Naitahu art. In Mirahiko, two large projections of swimming or dancing figures in water are overlaid with floating fragments of text, accompanied by a haunting soundtrack. The texts are drawn from email conversations circulated among a group of Naitahu members that Rakana is a part of. Rakana suggests that email creates another way for people to come together as a community and korero, or talk, regardless of where they live. She says that through this pool of image and sound, she's creating an opportunity to allow emotions, life and death, business, cultural revitalization, gossip humor and information Carrero, to show the living culture of contemporary iwi on email. The title of the work is a play on words. The Maori word for computer is rorohiko, which can be translated as electric brain. Rakina substitutes the word rere, which has many meanings, including to flow, to fly, to be carried by the wind, to rise or escape, meanings which emphasize the fragmentary nature of the texts and the fluid movements of the figures. In Maori culture, the land or whenua is extremely important, as is the idea of Turanga Waiwai, your place to stand, the place you come from. Talking about Rerehiko, Rakana has said, I have continued to use images of swimmers immersed in water with no reference to land, to explore the idea of shifting identities, of the freedom that might exist in an undefined space with no place to stand. No turanga.